What is guided drawing? It is mostly practiced with adults and for an art therapy approach, very unusual, clients draw with their eyes closed and with both hands. So very often I actually introduce this approach as that it is more like a self-massage than art therapy where you create images. So while clients have their eyes closed, their focus is on whatever is happening in their body. And say, for example, you feel a lump in your stomach or you have tension in your shoulders. This lump in the stomach is not translated into an image and then put on the paper but rather that you use rhythmic repetition to lump on the paper as it lumps in your stomach. Or you recreate the exact movement of the tension in your shoulders through repetition on the paper until there is a clear sense of, yes, that's how it feels. And the next part is then, to sense what do I need here if I want to release this tension and then rhythmic repeated movements are drawn in order to release whatever is held and blocked in the body. This has proved most beneficial for clients suffering from either complex trauma or particular traumatic events in their lives. These clients very often experience strong body sensations when they're very activated that feel out of control for them or they actually shut down and they feel nothing and are numb. And at the same time very few of them have words for what is happening or a story. They are just very focused on the symptoms that they carry in their body. Guided drawing can offer them a primarily non-verbal language to express what is happening as well as facilitate relief of their symptoms which can be over time very empowering. Thank you.